All right, it's uh, it's like 10.30 and we're just getting rolling. We're gonna go to the gas station, get some diesel. And we're gonna head south down to, uh, I think it's called Kingsville or something. Let's take a quick look at uh, Junction as we pass through. Here's one more look at the courthouse. And here we go by the Texas Theater again. Seventy one degrees outside. and windy so we'll get back to you as we get down going down down the road oh you need a deer blind there you go right there old church okay so we're on the road adios so we have a new development um we do that about five miles from junction rv went into limp mode says my dpf filter is clogged uh, closest Mercedes dealer is a couple hours from here. I talked to them. Said I can drive it in limp mode, but it's kind of tricky driving on an interstate with an 80 mile an hour speed limit at 40 miles an hour. Uh, we're going to disconnect the battery. The guy suggested that. Let it sit for a little while, see if it'll reset. But other than that, it looks like it's going to be a Mercedes service day, but I got to get to the dealership. So it's going to be a challenge today. Ha! So um, it's just frustrating, but um, I don't know. We're gonna get it figured out one way or another. So right now we're sitting. I will give you an update on what happens. Um, today is not gonna be a fun day. All right, guys, hang in there, Brian. Hang in there, Genki. Genki just says, you got plenty of food in case we get stuck? Yes, Genki, got plenty of Gohan, okay? All right. Kingsville, Texas, at a Walmart. I talked to the Mercedes guy, and he said, try to disconnect the battery. Wait 10 minutes after you turn it off, disconnect the battery, let it sit for 10 minutes, reconnect the battery, and son of a gun, it worked. So we drove all the way down here, and it was by far the windiest conditions I have ever, ever driven in. Um, even the, even in the parking lot right now, the RV is rocking. So we're not going any farther. It's 4.30 now, and we're just staying right here. But we made it. It was really a tough day. Um, boy, that's all I can say. I'm just glad we're done. So I didn't really have any time to take any videos or anything because I couldn't take my hand off the steering wheel. I did a couple... Uh, that I'll have on here that you'll see when I was driving up, but I couldn't even go the speed limit. I could only go like, the speed limit would be 75, I could maybe go 55. And um, uh, man, I just really thought we were gonna get blown off the road a couple times. But we made it, we're here. I got a peanut butter and jelly tortilla. Do you wanna share this with me? He says yes. So I'll make some more later before we end the day, okay? Okay, this is standing in the parking lot at Walmart. This isn't, this is like sheltered in here. This is nothing like it was out on the road and it's still so strong I can barely walk in it. Holy moly!
Okay, our day is done. Genki had his Gohan. I'm gonna eat a salad. There's our Walmart parking lot. Tomorrow, we're gonna be in Padre, and then we can throw out the anchor to the RV and sit back and relax and do some of the stuff that we wanna do. So, gonna have to give Genki a haircut. Gonna have to wash the RV. Might even have to give me a haircut. So, so anyway, there we are, guys. Sun's going down. Everything is good. And I am going to sign off. And next video, hopefully, will be us arriving in Padre. Night.